Hi, this is attorney Nicole Christie from the Christie Law Firm, where we work hard to make families stronger. And so today I want to answer a question that we often get in, and that is, how soon can I get my children back? Can I get them within a month? Can I get them within a short period of time? And so I will say to you, it all depends. And I know that's a hard answer to hear, but it really does depend. I have seen people get their children back in less than a month. And normally it's because the circumstances are different. Maybe DCF made a rash decision and there was other options. <clears throat> For example, a relative who could come in and move inside the home and stay to help safeguard the family, or there's another alternative to taking the kids. So sometimes we'll see that can happen. Other times, maybe it was something brief. Maybe it was something having to do with the mother or father, and it could be remedied very quickly. And so there is that possibility. But I would say, generally speaking, it does take a while. It is a process to get your children back. I will say that there are certain factors that help move that process along a little faster than others. So one thing you could do is make sure you understand what are the specific steps and start doing them right away. If DCF makes recommendations for services, start doing it right away. They're going to you know, recommend certain things and you might have a disagreement with that or maybe you're thinking, I don't need this program or another one. And this is where our office could help. In hiring us, what we do is try to advocate for you and say to DCF, well, that service doesn't look like it's appropriate. What about this service? And sometimes they will you know, agree and make that modification. So nevertheless, the faster you engage in services is the faster it can be for your children to come back home. Another factor that is helpful, and this is the one that I find my most hard for parents, is not arguing with DCF. The reason being is DCF is our pros at arguing. They can fight a case and fight a case for months on end, but the problem is it's your kids that aren't coming home during that entire fighting process. So for example, if DCF is saying, hey, mom did X, Y, and Z, and you agree with X, it's no sense in fighting over X when maybe Y and Z might be true. But nevertheless, it's more important to ask DCF, what do I need to do to get my kids back and start doing that right away versus getting back and forth with them about particular facts. That is something left for us, the attorneys, to go over and to see if it really does make a difference in terms of getting the children back. If it's an old fact or something that happened in your past, we can't change the past, but what we can do is make sure that the future <clears throat> doesn't look like the past and saying, hey, these are the things that are different. That is the voice that you have in our office. We are fighting for you. We're the ones that are pushing back on DCF. What we need you to be able to do is to be able to say, I've done X, Y, and Z. I've made sure that I've made certain kinds of changes in my life. You know, I've done things a little bit differently. You know, sometimes we'll have uh, individuals say, I've gone to treatment. I've done everything I'm supposed to do but yet for example they're still drinking when they're going to AA meetings but they're still drinking on the weekends that is an issue because DCF will say yeah you're going to services but there is no change so what they want to see is a change in behavior a change in speech a change in the reasons why the DCF had to become involved in the first place and as soon as they know that you have done all the things that you're supposed to do they should be working back working towards getting the kids back to you that is where I think we make a difference as well, is that sometimes DCF's timeline is a little slower than what we would like it to be. They may wait until you know there's another court date, which could be months down the road before they decide, okay, maybe we'll file something to get the kids back home. What our office does is we'll look, we'll analyze with you, we'll make sure that you're following through what you need to do, at least at giving you advice about how to do that. And as long as we know that all these things are done, we have enough ammunition is what I call it, to go into court and say the kids should be coming back now. And so we would find, you know, file the necessary um, motions and things like that to be able to get you to that point. So in that, that is the best way we see as far as being able to get your kids back is two parts. It's your willingness to cooperate and cooperate quickly and the advocacy of your attorneys, attorneys like us. So if you do need any assistance, especially in getting your children back, please don't hesitate to contact our office. We'll do everything that we can within our powers to be able to assist you. Take care. Bye-bye.